Hello everyone, my name is Daria Shizhenko and I'm a staff writer at the Kyiv Post and this is our travel vlog. The Kyiv Post will show you the top 10 places to see in Kyiv in one day. Let's get it started! Start the journey at Kyiv Central Independence Square or Maidan Nezalezhnosti, where the Independence Monument is located. Today is a lively square full of shops and cafes, but it was also the site of all the biggest protests in independent Ukraine's history, including the 2014 Euromaidan Revolution. Just a seven-minute walk from Maidan Square will bring you to St. Sophia Cathedral, a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The cathedral was built in the 11th century and is currently one of the seven cultural and historical monuments called the Seven Wonders of Ukraine. Live music shows often take place in the cathedral courtyard in the summer. Whoa! 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 This place is beautiful, but let's see what else is there. A 10 minute walk along Volodymyrska Street will bring you to Andreevsky Descent, where St. Andrew's Church rises over the hillside. It is also one of the most Instagrammable places in Kyiv. The church offers a picturesque view of the capital. You can also find many restaurants and cafes nearby. Oh, and by the way, don't miss Vestvizhenka, the recently built neighborhood with luxury houses that mimic historic buildings of the capital. Walk down Andreevsky descent for less than 20 minutes and head right into the historic Podil neighborhood, home of Kontraktova Square. It now features fairs and festivals, as well as a Ferris wheel that offers a great view of the neighborhood. There is no need to leave the historic part of Kyiv to see the Dnipro River. The embankment and Pashtova Square are only 15 minute walk from Kontraktova Square. Next, we head to St. Michael's Monastery, another historic site. But if you're still not tired of walking, let's see the official presidential residence, Marinsky Palace. Marinsky 
Palace is a Baroque residence built in the 18th century. The palace's visitors can rest at the nearby park. Just a 7-minute walk down Bankova Street will lead you to the Horodetsky House or the House with Chimeras. Its unusual design has given rise to a number of rumors and mystical legends that the building is haunted by ghosts. To end this perfect day in Kyiv, you should definitely see the Soviet-era Motherland Monument. The monument is a part of the World War II Museum complex. Some people now joke that since the sculpture faces Moscow, it is protecting Ukraine from Russian aggression. As the day in Kyiv comes to an end, stop by the Dnipro River, enjoy the sunset and make a wish to come back to Kyiv. The city has a lot to offer. Subscribe and follow the Kyiv Post on social media and read us in print or online at kyivpost.com.